welcome back to Raven's Port. Um. Yeah. I don't remember what we were doing. Oh, that's right. That. Uh uh. All right. Uh, da, 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 da. We need to get that drilled. Fertilized and drilled. I think it needs plowed too. That it does. Could also use a coat of lime, but I don't think I'm going to do lime. There it is. So we're going to knock that out. Nah. Uh, problem is I don't have another tractor. If I had another tractor, what I would do is I would put a worker on this and mow that stuff. What is the horsepower rating of my mower? 80. started up one a fent farm or yeah fent duh I'm doing a uh uh dark forest on my own time which is turning out to be a fent farm so that's kind of on my brain right now. I could get the fiat it is a hundred and fifty horse it would do the job and I'd still have a little bit of money left over. Again, I could also get the fin The vouchers ain't bad. Slot count sucks. I mean, that will open some things up if we buy another tractor. However, I want to check something. We're we doing big reds, yeah. 176 for a step up of Massey's. Ninety-eight for the case. And the problem is, literally, well, the exception of that, because that thing sucks on those big honky trees. With the exception of that, we still need everything. 
I gotta, gotta figure out a way of moving that tree. I think I might have a way. You know what? We're gonna set. Um. Oh, okay. <laughs> I'm gonna try something real quick. Bear with me. I don't even know if this is gonna work, but if it does, it'll be funny. So we need this. Oh, I still got wheat in there. Why do I still got wheat in there? Was I waiting for wheat to go up? Five seventy-two, right at the end of my driveway. I mean, I know I'm not waiting for a silo because it's literally going to take me forever to buy a silo. You know what we might do this episode? Wow. Made that look like I knew what I was doing. But we're going to try and get rid of that tree. And for that, I need to do this. Like I said, bear with me. I don't know if this is going to work. Famous last words, right? Come on, baby. Come on, big girl. Get that thing out of there. Yeah, redneck ingenuity. Or a surefire way of getting a tree stuck in a field. I'm going to pan back a little bit. i got to see what I'm doing. I'm gonna pull. No, we're not. We're good. Okay, this is gonna be a very, very slow pace, and I think it'll be funnier to watch in fast, fast motion. So, <laughs> I got the perfect song for it too. 
I'll see you when I get over to the sawmill. <laughs> Enjoy. <laughs> That was torture. Um, yeah, the next time I attempt something stupid like that, I think I'm going to call Rusty Money up so he can uh, hop in his little cop car and, well, cop truck and block traffic for me. Whoa, tree. Oh, that was bad. That was so bad. Mental note. Let's not do that again. Alright, let's head back down to the farm and crash out for the night. And then we'll decide what we're doing with a new tractor. Oh boy, I bet I left bits and pieces of that tree laying all over the place, didn't I? Hey, there's one. I wonder if I can pick that up. Hey, I can. I think that's what we might also do, in the daylight that is, find all the pieces that I left laying around. <laughs> Alright, I'll see you guys in a minute. Oh, 
that was bad. That was bad. That was just so oh, 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 bad. I picked this branch up. No, too heavy. Too heavy. I swear in this game, people are weaklings. branches. Watch, I'll be able to pick the end one up. No problem. But then the middle one that I cut out. Oh, look at that, I can still pick it up. I must have ate my weighties this morning. sharpened Last time I tried doing this with one of these trees, I was cutting it into slivers, and it just was not allowing me to pick it up. So I'm actually quite impressed. This might have been one of the updates that they did. It actually allows to pick slightly heavier stuff up. Not that. Cut it in half, see what happens.
I think it might be in my best interest. That's not even going to get touched by a strap. Might be in my best interest to go over and actually put the sides back on this. We're going to run this over to the shop or over to the sawmill and then I'll do that. We're going to start the tractor first. I'm getting this tree out of here. One way or another. <laughs> Just see the path of devastation. In Odin's name, did I do that? Oh, that's how. No collision. Are you kidding me? Can't even see the stinking log, and it's too t or too heavy. Whoops. Where's that other piece? Is that it? We go again. At least I don't have to worry about it getting caught on trees and cars. And I'll be honest with you guys, I was seriously about ready to turn the traffic off until I got it over there. When I got caught on that car over here, because I was trying to back up and it just hey, look at that a little. Sorry, ADD squirrel moment. Yeah, when I got caught here, it just would not back, uh, um, yeah, we'll go up. I had her in reverse, but she just was not backing up. I think that car had me wedged. Heck, I wasn't even overly sure where the sawmill was. I knew it was over here somewhere, but I'd honestly never been there. All the times that I've played this game and, heck, even been on this map, I've never been to the sawmill. Might have been able to get that full tree through here. <laughs> now I just got 2300 for those scraps. 
That was a loud bass. Your fault. I just got 2300 for those scraps. And half of that for the entire trunk. Now, we're going to put the sides back on this. We're going to cut the rest of that bit up. And we're just going to chuck it in the... So... I will see you guys when that's done. Called a crazy hunch, but I don't believe that's going to be the last piece that I lose on this trip. <sighs> oh, boy. Alright, now, the tree is gone. Might be one or two branches still left laying around. Let's go sell this off, and then we're going to buy our new tractor. And, well... Yes, I'm sticking with the Massey. And we're going to get another 5,500. I know, I know, I know. I could probably go with the Fiat and get... Uh, the better horsepower. Like I said, I want to stick with the Masseys. Oh, y'all notice whenever I just barely made it across the tracks before the train showed up on the way back? <laughs> Had to. Now it's stuck on my front end. <laughs> oh, boy, oh, boy, oh, boy. At least we got the tree cut up. Look at that, we made it up here. Okay. I'm thinking maybe we will get the fi yeah, the Fiat. I mean it is 150 horsepower. It's not that bad of a tractor, and there was no chance I was gonna get that full tree up that hill. 
Okay. Well, I'll tell you what. I'll let you guys pick. Should we stick with the big reds? Or should we throw a white and orange in that mix? I mean, the thing will stand out like a pimple. We're going from a horsepower rating. It is 20 more than this, and... I believe this is fully update or upgraded. So, we're not going to buy it today. I am going to hit the fence. But we're not going to buy it today. We're actually will uh get that field plowed. It'll be the last time lapse of the episode. Don't worry. We'll get that field plowed and get it drilled. I guess that's going right there. Now let's take the weight off the back, stick it back on the front. And let's see if we can pick this stupid thing back up. That figures. Oh, for the love of the gods. This is really getting annoying. Now I need to come over here. I need to get my front lift. Put that on. Lift this stupid thing up. ideas. I was going to say, you flop over again, I'm going to sell you. Right where you sit. I'm going to put some music to this and
We'll get this done. It's going to take a little while. I will see you when it's done. I'm not even messing with plowing. There's a reason I don't in this game. And even even with that, and I mean this thing, this thing's going to take freaking forever. And I'm not I'm not going to subject you guys to that either. So, honestly, I'm probably going to put this one a worker. Let them go to town. Because this is going to drive me absolutely crazy. I, I, yeah. This dinky, dinky little, little piece of machinery here. Um. Yeah, so I'm laying grass down. And we're gonna mow it all up and then I'm probably going to take that strip out of the center there and combine these fields before putting an actual crop in it but right now I just want to get grass laid And get that silage pit filled. So that we can uh, start getting some money that way. Not sure what we're going to do about the BGA because that is so freaking expensive. But I'm going to wrap up the party there. Glad you guys came along. Hope you had a pretty good laugh with that tree moving debacle. Like I said, I'm going to probably put this one a worker so that I get everything. I'm used to using something so small. I can't wait for the comments. So, oh, that's what I wanted to do. I wanted to put a headland up here on this top line. Because I know from past experience, these workers are idiots when it comes to the top line. I'm sorry, I just had to sneeze. So yeah, I'm going to get a worker on this. I'm going to let you guys go. You got some other fun things to watch. Uh, if you haven't watched the Montana episode yet, that one's pretty good. Quite frankly, I can't remember what I did because it was like four days ago that I recorded it. Three days ago that I recorded it. So... Go ahead, watch that. And tell me what I did. <laughs> I'll talk to you all later. Bye.